In other news, a federal court jury says the owner of a McDonald's restaurant on Maui should pay more than $5 million to a woman who slipped and fell and broke her back. It's one of the biggest slip and fall awards in Hawaii history. In an exclusive interview, the badly injured woman says the money won't end her suffering. KITV4's Daryl Huff has her story. Paula Beverly Mungia and her family went to McDonald's in Kahului for breakfast in November three years ago. She got up for drinks and slipped, and even though the accident led to a $5 million verdict, her life will never be the same. I could tell from the amount of pain that I was very, very seriously hurt. Beverly Mungia was an active volunteer for charity and enjoyed her independent lifestyle, but the fall at the Dairy Road McDonald's ended all that. The loss of my mobility, the loss of my independence, the loss of being able to do the things that I had done um, as a very active and very busy person has been very hard to come to terms with and I'm still dealing with that. Restaurants are not automatically liable for falls by their customers, but Bungia's attorney said the jury agreed unanimously that the Dairy Road McDonald's didn't do a good enough job keeping its floor clean. They're their internal rules, they're rules they get from the McDonald's Corporation, and they didn't follow any of them. Franchise owner Grillin Rosario expressed sympathy for Mungia, but said the verdict, $2.6 million for actual medical damages and lost income, and $3 million for pain and suffering, was disappointing, excessive, and not representative of the facts in the case. The restaurant owner says, as always, I remain vigilant in my efforts to provide a safe restaurant for my employees and customers. It wasn't vigilant enough for the jury in this case, or Mungia who hopes the verdict sends a message to other businesses. That they have a responsibility, that customer safety absolutely must come first. Because, she said, the money won't end her 24-hour pain. It's actually unlikely that she will ever see all that money. Big awards are often reduced on appeal or during a settlement, Paula. Daryl, is couldn't this verdict affect other cases? It could, because now it will be something that personal injury attorneys can point to. It may lead defendants in other lawsuits to settle for a little more to avoid a big potential jury verdict, Paula. All right, Daryl, thank you very much.